You can finally get your Mutt Master Ryan Shazier up to level 99 or whatever the tier is, however you want to call it, the 99 overall. But there's a lot that has to go into it, and it's kind of weird the way that they did it. But I'm going to go through everything that you need to know about getting your Mutt Master Ryan Shazier up to 99 overall. And also some things that you may be able to get for free later on by using certain things that you got initially when you completed a lot of the things that went into the original Mutt Master uh, Ryan Shazier. So we're going to talk about that and more right now. Let's get it. All right, so look, before we get into the actual whole thing with the 99 overall Ryan Shazier, I want to point out that I'm going to be asking some questions about this as far as, um, let me, do they have it as collectibles? How do you have it? Uh, core team items? Uh, da -da -da -da, the master? All right, so, okay, yeah. Like, these things like this, right? What EA Sports is probably going to do with this, I just want to point it out. They're going to probably have some other set that these things are going to go into later, I don't know why they did it, you know, with the way that it is right now where you have to go through so much more to actually get him up to his overall of a 99, but we're going to go over that in a second. Now, remember, these were additional things that you got if you played all the online games to complete um, Master Shazier or you did it offline. I did both. I did the solo route and I played the online game, so I was able to get double the amount for it. So I'm pretty sure they're going to be doing something for that. Now for the Mutt Master Ryan Shazier and what you're going to need to do to get that done. Let's go over here to uh, Objectives and Mutt Level, and we're going to go over uh, right here to the Mutt Master Finale. All right, so look, you need 150 games. No, you do not have to play them online. All right, some people were writing that. You have to play it online, and uh, when EA did their stream, oh, yo, oh, no, it's not online. Any of the any games, bro, as long as it's not play a friend, you got to play 150 of them, all right? So you got to win five games and with a 95 overall. So obviously we already have that part done. Um, pretty much what's ha what's happening is this, right? You're gonna it's gonna be an issue for some people that have lower overalls. Uh, how to get you know you're gonna be like yo bro, how do I get my overall up? Pretty much what I'm going to suggest right now. Most of the Ultimate Legends are very, very cheap. I don't know if it's going to continue to be that way because with the new promo with the scouting points, everything has gone back up in price. But I'm pretty sure that you should be able to get to a 95 overall because most of you guys, if you've played all your solos, they've given you guys a lot of 94, 95 overall cards. Plus with the Super Bowl promo, some of you guys got 96, 97 overall with chems because if you pick the... um the blue team, you got an extra overall. And then if you put chemistries on these players, it can also raise their overall. So there's a lot of different ways to get your overall up. But primarily, you're going to have to you know, really grind a lot of solos or you're going to have to buy packs. The next thing you're going to have to do is reach level 80. I told you guys that you should have been already at 70 using their, you know, their double XP for any mode over the last couple weeks and things of that nature. So you're going to have to go 10 more levels to get that done. And then finally, you're going to need 25 daily objectives. Right here on this um, this segment right here, you're not going to be able to see anything else for the initial Mutt Master uh, having to do with Ryan Shazier because I already completed it. But I do have a playlist explaining to you guys how to complete specific aspects of Mutt Master Ryan Shazier. Okay, so that you guys can understand it. If you're just jumping into it right now, you're like, yo, I want that 99 overall card, GMI, how do I do it? I went through it all and showed you guys initially how I did it in the Mutt Master playlist. So this video will be in that playlist. So just click on the playlist on YouTube and then you'll be able to see everything that's going on. Now we're going to go back into the lineup and I'm going to show you uh, what his stats are going to be looking like once you upgrade him all the way fully because obviously it shows it to you. Uh, if you just click on the card once the card is eligible for an upgrade. So once we get to this part, we should all be here with this guy right there, the 95 overall, whatever, right? As you go down through this, you're going to ultimately end up here. Yes, that's beautiful card art. Looks really, really good. I don't like that he can't get out of my way, but that's neither here nor there. Don't worry about that too much. What I will try to point out to you is this, right? You don't have anything that's eligible for it to start. You have to do those things that are written in the objectives list to be able to start getting the token. So no, the things that I just showed you early in the video do not apply to this card anymore. But I'm pretty sure that EA will be working on something to give you guys something else to be able to use those tokens for at a later date. Once I have any information on it, I will let you know. So now, it's all about pursuing him. It's good that I did not 
play all the solos that were going on uh, through Super Bowl and all the other stuff because now I can play those solos, including the all new journey, and be able to ultimately take care of the first part of the objectives in the mutt level. Now remember, I just want to point this out as well. It doesn't matter how fast you do this, you can pretty much go this, this route because you have to wait 24 more days. So there's literally nothing else you can do. Like you have to wait. So ultimately when you start going through um, you know, your mutt levels, it resets your daily objectives. You might be able to get it done in 21 days, but it doesn't really matter. You still have to go through all of this. So now to prove to you guys about the win 150 games, the player friend excluded that the solos count, we're gonna go over right now and we're gonna go through, we're gonna you know play a solo. And uh, I'm gonna pick one, uh, scouting the NFL. We'll do one of these because um, this is for the new part with the scouting. The, uh, the top right, you see the, uh, the scouting currency. This is all new. So let's see what's going on here. So it's the ultimate moment and um, we're gonna play it and then we're just gonna you know double check with it to make sure that those things are highlighting up inside what you need to get done just so that most of my guys that never play online that were very, very scared because people were spreading false rumors that you have to be online. Now you'll know that you can just do all your stuff offline and get it done. Um, and if you only got Mutt Master Shazier through doing stuff offline, you can still continue to get him to a 99 overall by doing stuff offline. All right. So and doing solo battles and things of that nature. So don't really worry about all the I wouldn't worry about the solos that much because if you even do what do you need? 20 days. So if you do like, you know, 10 days, you, you go you go like 10 solos a day for 20 days. That's 200. So you don't have to go crazy trying to get everything done up until that point where it's going to be over. I think that that's why they did it like that where they made you have to wait with the daily quick, the, you know, the daily objectives, because that makes it so that you have to wait for that extra, you know, that extra time or whatever, um, because people are going to be going wild trying to complete it. So the most, I, I think it's like, what is it like? I think it resets after every certain level. So I guess you could save some days. I got to make sure because I haven't leveled up in a while. Um, once I start doing it, I'll, I'll definitely let you guys know what's going on with it. But you can get it. You can get it sooner. I don't know how you just spin move through all those people. Run it out, bro. What are you doing? Run it out. I don't know how you just spin with all those people, but it doesn't really matter. Um, so, yeah, you can get it sooner, but it all depends on how many times uh, you get your stuff done with the daily objectives, uh, how many levels you can, you know, go over each time. I think that it, it only happens when you get, like, a new pack in the store or something. Like, when you know, I, I got to show it to you guys. But, yeah, like, when you when it resets at a certain level, I think it probably only happens, like, three times. But you guys can let me know because uh, I don't remember. But I'm going to have to go through it anyway, so I'll be able to... Um, explain it to you further, but yeah, it's at certain points and certain levels, it resets your daily objective and you can do it twice in one day. Um, so you probably, they're going to be guys running around with them earlier than, um, what I just told you, uh, just so you, so that pretty much explains how they're going to be doing it. All right. And so that it's no confusion with that. So we're going to, we're going to finish up this solo. We just have to pretty much get the ball back. I, I think that most of these solos have it so that, um, the computer has no timeouts. So because they have no timeouts, you're going to have to do exactly what I just did. You're going to just play defense, come out, pick them off, and then you're going to just come out. You can run the ball. You can kneel, whatever, and just have two clock on. And this is primarily how you're going to run through everything. It's going to be very, very simple. You're not going to have any issues doing it. I can promise you that it'll be very, very, um, you know, it'll be very, very simple doing it. Uh, you're just going to have to put the time in to get it done. That's it. And then you'll be able to, um, you know, pretty much get everything done within that 20 one to 22 day uh, time period. But that that's what I'm estimating. I'm estimating that that's what's going to happen as far as how long it's going to take certain people to do it. Remember, I believe you can repeat solos. I think you can. I think you can repeat solos. So you can probably go to the older gauntlets and just play those. I, I, I'm going to check. I'm going to check now. I'm going to check. I'm not going to tell you guys to do it. Let's go check it. So this was a brand new solo that I'd never played. Just to point that out. So when we go out of this, when we go back to the objectives and the mutt level, it should show one for both the um, winning a game with a 95 overall or above and also 150 um, solos. But what I want to check to make sure that we're up to, you know, we're up to speed with it is that you can repeat the same solo. So you can go to the gauntlet, throw a touchdown pass, stuff like that. And that, um, you know, it's pretty much over with that situation. So let's go back. Um, we're going to get some XP right quick. Oh, first solo win of the day. Bro, we should have did the other thing with the, um, the double. Could we get double XP with the other situation? All right, so this quick sells for 50. We'll go ahead and take that real quick, get our scouting up. All right, let's back out of this, and we're going to go just double check with the objective and the mutt level. Then we're going to double check with um with how it works with the uh, thing there. Hold on. All right, so look. 
we got one of 150, so that works. So you can see that the solos offline works, and you can see that we got the one win there. All right. Now what we have to do is this. We have to go back, and we're going to go to um, a solo that we've already done and um, see how that works. So let's pick, uh, let's go, I like to do like the simple ones. Oh, wait a minute, wasn't it? I think I just did a simple one uh, recently. Where is it, this one? Uh, was it this? Let me see. I think it was this one, this one was pretty easy. So all we had to do was, with a time constraint, what? Okay, by finish this, you are 94. What did we have to do? I don't remember, what was the last thing we just did? Do not allow, allow more, okay, this one, pass for a TD in two plays. All right, let's do this. It's on rookie mode. So we'll just pass for a TD, and then it'll be over. It's it's on rookie mode, and it's arcade, so you should be able to do it. And we already you can see that we already did it. So let's see if it counts um, towards doing everything, because if that's the case, you can just go into gauntlet mode and just do the thing where you pass for one touchdown and just keep doing it over and over again. And that way, you don't have to really worry about anything. But I don't know if they updated it to make it so that you can't repeat the same solo, because some, some of you guys have told me that for certain times, they wouldn't let it update inside the uh, level of progress for previous uh, things that they released. So I just want to make sure. That way we confirm it right now in the video. So that way, even if you don't want to grind out the new solos, you can just go back and just, you know, go to Gauntlet, go to this one, whatever. Whatever is like a one-play thing to give you the win, because that way if you just say you do it 20 times for the day, you'll be done with that aspect of it, and you can move on from it. All right, so we got a pass for a TD in two plays. Obviously, it's arcade mode, so aggressive catching is your friend. You come out. Well, we don't need to come out like that. We can just come out. And do some weird stuff over here. Okay, what what is all this stuff? I don't even know what this is. It doesn't matter. We're just gonna throw a streak. Why is why is cursing my game ever? And why can't I do double hot routes? Oh, cause I got John Elway. Oh yeah. So these are stupid. Cause you don't get your you don't get your whole real team. All right, we're just gonna throw the ball up to Calvin right quick. All right, go right there. Catch the ball. I'm awesome. All right, good job. Now, if this updates, that's beautiful for all of you guys. Cause you could just go to um like I said, go. I'm gonna show you the solo to do if it updates. Because you could just go to go to Gauntlet. You could do the thing like rush for a touchdown from one yard out. Do all those. They're very, very easy. Very, very simple. Over. Get it done with. Easy. Easy. Easy, easy. Easy, easy, peasy, greasy, bro. And then you still get XP. Very little, but you still get XP. All right. So let's back out of this. And um, what we're going to do is we're going to just double check that in objectives and mutt level right there. All right. So look. So Okay. So it works like that. So you can repeat each one. So that should make it very, very easy to get this done, this done. Um, this is going to be pretty, you know, you got to put some time in for this. You're going to have to get through. We got to grind it out for that, bro. Like, it's going to be some serious business. And then ultimately, once you're done with this, it's just going to be a matter of time. So to get through this part right here, this will be the fastest way. This will be the fastest way right here. Just going into um, the gauntlet and repeating solos that you've already done if you've done them. Um, go to the first one. Where is it? Where is it? Where is the gauntlet? The first gauntlet one. Uh, the rookie gauntlet. And then you go to like a uh, rushing ladder and then you see this one, you rush from a TD from one yard out. Very, very easy. You run a toss play every single time. It'll be a touchdown. Do that a hundred and whatever amount of times that's all done and you're finished and ready to go. And you'll have everything done up until we have to wait for the daily objectives. And then, you know, other than that, just grind out up until level 80 and just wait. We'll just wait it out from there. And then you're going to have to come in, log in every day and that'll pretty much be it. You'll have 99 uh, Mutt Master Ryan Shazier. If you have any other questions, feel free to leave it in the comments. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. How many of you guys going after 99 overall? Mutt Master Ryan Shazier. Let me know in the comments. One love.